in in 2005, I keynoted the the first Wikimania conference, and and I want to show you some slides I pulled from that deck. Uh, I, I called the talk uh, uh, from uh, where from and where to, and a little bit of history of my thinking that led to Wiki, but more importantly, what I thought where I thought Wiki was in 2005, and and uh, some challenges that uh, that I presented. And, and of course, uh, this is relevant here because, you know, I think that uh, some of the challenges are unmet, and and uh, this work is uh, addressing it. So uh, I started by uh, describing, you know, my original interest in in communication networks. This is uh, so old; it, it dates back to my days in college, and it was reproduced by Mimeograph and. As I've told people that, they, I, now I have to mention, you have to look that up to find out what a mimeograph is. But I was clearly thinking about uh, connecting computers to radios and creating a network that could be uh, individually owned uh, and not dependent upon uh, uh, any other network, which at that time were very expensive and weren't hooked together in an internet. The, the uh, of course, now as we get to uh, the environment of 2005, integrated circuits and fiber optics are making computers cheap and communication cheap, and that's an environment uh, that uh, Wikipedia found itself, and, and of course we didn't have to, to, to make the, the, uh, the network ourselves with our own radios. Uh, but I had, by then, uh, had uh, oh, uh, uh, almost 10 years of experience with running a wiki and and I pointed out that my wiki was really about uh, uh, causing something to happen. It was an activist wiki uh, and, and that thing happened. It was the uh, agile methods emerged from uh, from my wiki and related work. Uh, with that however the period of exponential growth was over for uh, for me and, and uh, participation had sort of plateaued. Uh, it, it was actually still growing, but it felt like it was plateauing because there was just less original uh, work going on. Now, I, in 2005, I told the, uh, the Wikipedians assembled in Frankfurt that uh, that was going to happen to them too. I didn't know how high it was going to go, but uh, you know, there is not unbounded exponential growth. Now, uh, we do now know, uh, and of course there's this excellent work here, the uh, uh, Wikimedia Strategic Plan, which uh, is available online in PDF or, or in paper. And uh, it has in it a, uh, a graph that shows you the growth in uh, Wikipedia editors. And you can see I'm, I'm showing you 2005, and it, uh, it looks pretty, pretty, pretty close to what I predicted. You know, and I, I, this, of course, happens with anything exponential, and you get to these sort of different changes. You know, there. while well, you, you, you know, it's 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 happening on the surface of the earth, and am I actually kind of alluding in the title of this slide to a to an influential work by that title, of Limits of Growth, that talked about population. I I, I then went on to say, you know, these are, that that wiki, and especially Wikipedia, that scale of community has the power to reframe thought. Uh, we reframed computer programming into agile. Uh, Wikipedia is uh, maybe less about reframing. They have this neutral point of view. But I said these are these are the kinds of questions that really demand uh, everyone on Earth thinking about how they want to live, reframing uh, issues of population, energy, and climate. Uh, I'd actually been, uh, you know, even back as this paper was dated in 1997. Thinking about uh, how uh, how if everybody ran a wiki, how they would work together, and, and what that might be like. This is going back to my thoughts of everybody running a radio and a computer, and uh, I, I suggested that to really tackle a difficult question, something uh, that, that maybe the wiki property of putting everybody in one page is not the right thing. Uh, of course, I was thinking in objects because I'm an object guy and. And maybe maybe the wiki page is okay, uh, but here I was saying, gee, we could have these objects, and these objects are copied around uh, a, a network, and it, and that copying gives us an ability to uh, uh, let let uh, 
different kinds of sharing processes emerge. I closed with uh, this picture, which is uh, shows presumably every one of those squares is a server, and there's lots of things. Maybe this is a little blogosphere-ish, you know, in, in the sense that there's, you know, uh, extreme attitudes on uh, extreme corners of this, but as, as things get copied around, it means that there's a place in the network where uh, there's a balance of perspectives, and, and that's the place where I argued that the new framing of uh, uh, understanding uh, needs to be to to uh, uh, to to create the uh, to create the uh, uh, initiative that we need to tackle these large problems. Uh, I believe we're working on that now. My focus, of course, is much more on on data and uh, having uh, data comprehensible and close at hand. But and and the objects I've chosen are JavaScript. They even call them objects inside JavaScript. That's the JSON. But uh, this is uh, something that I go back and think about often in, uh, in, in the work that we've been doing.